Hello guys, I'm Lazera. Welcome back to Tiger Tasmanian Tiger 3. So, we are back at this very, very destroyed town. So, in this episode, apparently we need to find Duke. I don't know who that is, but he's crashed his helicopter. I have to go see where that is. Actually, before we do anything, I'm going to go to the shop. Because I remember seeing some shit that... Thought it would be nice to have. Is it Rangs? Oh, it wasn't Rangs, was it? It was... Stuff over here. But it's a shadow beam, won't that definitely? You. And then. I'll be drills. Oh, okay. Right, so we'll just go from the bottom to the top. Gauge one as it goes. Let's see what rangs we can get as well. Oh, it's just the stones in it. Oh, wait, there was a chester. Duo chester. I'm gonna get that. Come and see us again soon. Right, so we've just got some shit for our bunyip, and we've got a new boomerang. Right, so chassis, we now have duo chassis, it doesn't even... Oh, wow, I get it now. Right, so you know that you can put stones on your uh, boomerangs? If you see there, there's a stone directly in the middle of your boomerang, isn't there? Right, so that's a mono chassis, right, for one. Duo chassis, you see that one's got two rings. That's fucking pretty good, cool, like, isn't it? You can put two stones in. That one's got three stones, that one's got four stones, five, six, and that one's got no stones, but six stones you can have in one fucking boomerang, that's awesome. So that makes sense now. We could do with having stones on this one. We've only got water and ultra. We can buy more later. Right, so I am starting to understand the fucking boomerangs now. Ah, it's, because it's a water one, it's gone to ice now. Cool. Right, yeah. Anyway, let's continue with the mission. We need to find a guy called Duke. Oh god, not this elevator again. This elevator takes forever. What would be nice is if you could see the stones, you know, hanging off your boomerangs. Obviously, that's too much to ask for with a game like this old, but it would be pretty nice. Add that extra bit of detail. We can't go through this door yet in front of us because it's not open. I'm guessing we'll have the car by then. Drive around and shit. Got this way we've got. Two missions this side. A green and a purple. I'm killing these guys in like one hit now. That's fucking awesome. Oh god, these guys. Let's see if we can kill these in one hit. No, but I'm attacking them with ice. Seems a bit pointless when there's just a gap there. Oh right, my map's just fucked up so it was a loading area. That was a really sneaky one, that. Right, I should be able to... Yes, I can. Right, so it's a good thing that I've got an ice and a fire boomerang. My mono rang is like, got a fire stone on it, and my duo rang has a water stone on. So I've got the best of both there. I think the next rang I'll probably put like, lightning on it. And that way I've got like one of each element. At the fucking way. I wonder what other new enemies are going to be in this one as well. Like, I wonder if there's going to be like giant uber thrills that I can fight. Or oh, zombie uber- oh, there we go. Speak of the devil. Try and jump out of the way. <gasps> it's just had a skull and crossbow, man. Alright, I've got a feeling I'm not supposed to touch the floor. There's probably mines. Oh, god. Ah, oh, fuck it, I fell. Oh well. Oh, maybe that was just for a picture. I did see a picture at the end. Oh, what else? Oh god, what are these? I'm not gonna destroy it, I guess. They're like, start a chain reaction of explosions. I'm like a ninja at the moment, though, dodging always. <gasps> oh god. I've just seen a load of, like, koala dudes. But unfortunately. <laughs> I can't save them. Oh god! I think I've done it again. I uh, I can hear something big. Oh. Oh, maybe this is where I need to save people. I'll save Duke. Duke! Ty, is that you? I knew you were dead. Well 
Also, Duke was the pilot dude that I always kept mentioning. That dude's a bit of a dick in there. <laughs> Alright, kill all these dudes. Is that it? There's like only a few frills. Oh no! It does feel like, you know, this melee combat is like something that they really should have added in the first two games. But it feels like I'm using my boomerangs a bit less, unless it's against like normal thrills. I'm not using them against these queenkins. So it does feel like I'm not using my boomerangs as much as I used to. Right, um, I take it this is all going to crumble. Maybe? Oh no, it's not crumbling. I thought that would crumble under me. The fuck? Wow. Wow, he fucked me up. All oh, right. Right. I should have really read it first. Um, apparently, if you just throw boomerangs at the bridge, it will spin it. So we can get across now. But I'm gonna have to run across here myself anyway. Destroy them fuckers from. Attacking. Gonna repeat last time. Right, okay. Right, and just come here. Do that. And one more. Then I can get through. There we go. I'm not like the biggest fan of escort missions. I don't know what's just come through that door then, but it's big. Right, where's he gone? There he is. Come on, mate. Let's go. Um, okay. Oh, we can just run behind it. Okay. Right, we'll just we'll, we'll get ahead of him because he's a bit slow. Unfortunately, these mechanics are pretty cool though. Where you can like interact with the other scenery. Stand on a pressure pad and it will lower a floating platform for you to stand on. Okay. Right here we go. Is he on? Oh, yep. And we can jump up. Kill these guys while we're here. Right, we need to run over there and kill them ones as well. Let's get this health. Wow, oh, did a forward roll. That's pretty cool. Get back, you demons! Oh god, there's an opal bag there. I've not seen one of them in ages. received an emergency intelligence report. Apparently the Quinken have secretly been growing a weapon called a Flying Fortress, and they just taken to the skies. Luckily, we've been developing a little something of our own on the sly. <laughs> Go and see Duke, and he'll brief you on the capabilities of the new Gunyip. Oh, that sounds pretty interesting. Let me just check. Oh, this next mission actually is like through this gate, so I wonder if the gate's open now. 
And it is, they've rebuilt it. Oh, oh the crab mask. Well, these are them machines that the uh, frills had, you know, in the first and second game. Let's see, snip snip. What else can I do? Oh, I can. Oh, God. Wow. Sent a rocket. Oh, that's cool. Wow. I prefer this over the car. It's so much like easier to move. Well, going forward it's not, but turning is like easier. At least we've got something to do now while we travel rather than, you know, just driving around the road. <laughs> right, this should be here. Uh, how do we get in there? Let me in. Oh, here we go. Right, let's speak to Duke. Glad to see you here, sir. Things were starting to look grim for New Baramaji with all those fortresses flying about. You've got to come quickly, sir. Uh, what am I doing? No time to explain. Just come with me. Get you acquainted with the Gunya, shall we? She's the fastest and most maneuverable bird in the bush rescue fleet. Equipped with both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground munitions capabilities. You should have no worries taking on even the hardest of evil spirit invasions. In you hop. Uh, shouldn't I have a go on a simulator or something first? There's no time. Besides, there's no simulation like the real thing, sir. You'll get the hang of it. Okay. Right, so we need to destroy six Queen Can Flying Fortresses as quickly as possible. Watch out for Spider Queen Guard and the Flying Fortresses and all incoming. Right, okay. Oh, oh, wow. This feels hard to control already. Oh shit, you can drop a nuke. Oh god. That Queen Can Base thing looked like an eyeball. Right. There's my little aim for. Dropping the nuke then. What's this? Oh! There we go, that should drop a nuke. So we have to destroy the shit that's around them, don't we? These fortresses. Oh, so that power up gave me like super speed or something? Oh no, it gave me rockets that lock on. Ooh! Right, let's try and nuke this one as well. Alright, this is the last uh, flying fortress, I think. Let's get a good angle at it. Come on, die scum. I'll oh, kill myself again. And there we go. That was the last fortress. Quinkin what's what, hey? Yeah, I still wish you'd have showed me what's what first. Hey, we got five stone. Cool. Well, we're on two now. Right, anyway, that's it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again next time. Bye.